hello everyone welcome to my channel so in this video we will learn about IntelliJ shortcuts and see how these shortcuts can be helpful in day-to-day -day life of a software developer while developing or coding for a program so let's start so before starting up uh, the shortcuts I'll be showing you like uh, which currently key map I have uh, set it up in my IntelliJ so going up in the IntelliJ option in the settings in the key map i have selected or has by default mac os key map as i'm using mac os system i'm using currently mac os m2 pro system so i'm using the default mac os key map but if you are using on windows or if you are working on any other os then it will be showing in key map okay so you need to select that key map or you can select a different key map also while working on intellij id okay so i'll be showing up for both windows and mac so let's start also i'll be uh, you know providing a on screen keyboard so i'll be operating with this also for mac users so that it will be more familiar with you guys okay so let's start so in this video we'll learn about intellij panels so panels are basically you can see in the left hand window the project is a panel and we can see structures are there bookmarks in the bottom side version control find run debug so you know to activate a panel all these panels are denoted by a number okay so these panels are denoted with a number project with one structure with number three bookmarks with number two structure with i guess number seven okay version control with nine run with four debug with five okay so if i press alt one or command then one so it will activate the project panel okay we can see and if i again press the command one then it will you know come in this project in the code structure okay so it will activate this but if i again need to go to the project then i'll be go, uh, again pressing command one okay so you can see it then activates this but you know if i uh, need to you know uh, go to the structure then i need to again press command seven okay command is activated here you can see and now i'm going to press seven so you can see structure has been activated okay but you can also toggle in between these two suppose now structure has been activated and sorry my project has been activated and you can see a cursor here but if i wanted to activate project then i'm again going to press command one and you can see the cursor has been now moved to my project okay so in this way you can switch uh, into the both okay or toggle in both suppose now if i wanted to you know work with debug window and i have selected my breakpoints okay and if i wanted to open or run my program first then what i can do is simply open command 4 to you know see the run or console window here okay to see my output for my program to press here then i can use hello okay i can use the escape button you can see escape button okay then again let me show you this again shift sorry command 4 or alt 4 okay to start the run panel okay so i am pressing command 4 so now you can see this panel has been activated okay and now if i wanted to you know again going back to my you know project panel then i need to again press command 1 you can see this panel has been activated but if i wanted to you know minimize this then there is a shortcut shift escape okay so you can see that panel has been minimized and if i wanted to you know uh, concentrate on my coding and not wanted to you know get up some inputs from the structure or run menu if i wanted to you know minimize all i need to press shift escape okay by activating these so i need to activate first shortcut or you know run so i have activated run you can see the cursor here then i'll be pressing shift escape if i need to you know activate this structure then i need to again press sh command 7 and you can see uh, this cursor was on the structures and we can minimize this 
okay but if you can see if you are working upon a laptop or a small screen and you want your window to be maximized to the full then you there is a shortcut or i would say a key on the left hand side bottom of your intellij this one so you can simply press this and you can see all these shortcuts will go away all these panels will go away and you can concentrate on coding up your or doing up your work and you will get a, a max size window okay and you can again press this okay so another shortcut uh, is command 5 if you are you know working up with the debug window okay so you can see debug window is here so you can uh, use command 5 or alt 5 alt 5 in windows and command 5 in mac os to you know switch to your debug window and if you wanted to you know toggle up the cursor from your code to debug you can use the same command 5 to you know minimize this or command 5 now the cursor has been active in debug then you can use shift escape to either minimize this to you know activate toggle back to your code screen or escape to toggle cursor back to your project screen okay and if you wanted to open terminal like if you are working in windows you need to open cmd and you need to you know execute some commands or whatever uh, like if you wanted to execute or clean up your project using mv you can also use terminal inside the intellij so to open intellij terminal shortcut is option or alt f12 okay so we can see now our terminal has been open and if we same if we wanted to you know toggle the cursor escape would be the shortcut and if you wanted to you know again toggle or you know again uh, write up something in terminal toggle the cursor then option f12 again to comes back to the term then your cursor will be there okay and if you wanted to minimize this then shift escape okay and suppose i have opened multiple projects in my intellij and you can see by clicking on this window and you can switch in between these two so the shortcut is shift and this colon okay so using the uh, sorry not the shift command colon so using command colon you can toggle in between your intellij project so you can see my currently project open name this first project okay and if now i'm going to switch to my different project the name is spring boot project and again i'm going to switch back to this project so this is the shortcut we can you know switch to multiple projects open in intellij okay now if i wanted to open my vcs or version control window panel in my intellij then the shortcut is command 9 okay so in this way we can open this shortcut and in windows is alt 9 okay so these are all the shortcuts we can use in our day-to-day -day life while you know developing any program or coding so that's it for today thank you guys